there, folks! Welcome back to Y Forever's After Show! In this After Show, we will be discussing the events of episodes 25, 26, and 27. And as you can see, Wyatt is officially back on the show. That's right, I've returned. Let's get into the episodes now, shall we? Episode 25 marked the end of the whole Me in Australia arc. The rest of you were a little hyped for my return. Well, what were you expecting? You're kind of the main character. And it's also crazy how Brooke and Savannah got sucked into a black hole that they literally created. Good thing the director yelled God before anything else got sucked in. Then came the part where Wyatt came back. It was finally nice being back home again. I will admit, I was in Australia for so long, I almost forgot what Hazel Island looked like. My brain just does that every now and then, you know, where it just forgets things. Like, how in certain scenarios I have no clue what to say. I feel like that sometimes, too. And who even has that episode as their favorite? All that happens in it is me returning home from my trip. Well, there's always episode 26. And episode 26 was about radios. Lots and lots of radios. No, it was about claw machines. Which you and Aurora won your radios out of. And as it turns out, I'm terrible at claw machines. You weren't able to win anything! Nope. I have no idea how you and Simon were getting so lucky. We had a claw machine expert win all of my and Aurora's prizes behind the scenes, so technically we weren't winning either. Why did Blithley win something? Yeah, but Mackenzie stole my prize right then and there. Had Mackenzie not been in that episode, we wouldn't have even made the next one. Oh, thanks for reminding me, Aurora. Episode 27 picks up where 26 left off. I was so annoyed with my inability to win the claw machines that I actually resorted to smashing one with a mallet and grab a prize. But then again, I'm not the brightest bulb in the box, so can you blame me, really? I had to take away the mallet you were gonna break the machines with, because no one likes a cheater. The human pyramid was really too tricky to pull off. We were falling over and over before getting it right. I could imagine how bad I, it was falling several times, but I would know. I wasn't even in the pyramid. But then at the end, you finally did win something. Yep, and Mackenzie didn't steal it this time. I still don't understand how the prize levitated upwards, though. Wait, that reminds me. I almost forgot to do something. Here you go, Michaela. Thanks for helping White win the claw machine. Okay, I'm back. Well, thanks for joining us tonight, folks. In the 10th After Show, we will be going over episodes 28, 29, and 30. 